Hi guys, this is Mrs. Googie again. Welcome back here on my YouTube channel. Please make sure you subscribe, like, and comment on the videos because I, look, I put a lot of work and energy in these readings and I'm thankful when you guys appreciate my work. Also, you might be interested in getting a private reading, so check the description box for more details. I did um, some US election reading in the past about who will be next president of the United States in 2024. I also did a reading on Donald Trump a few weeks ago. And now you guys have requested to do a reading on Joe Biden this time. I will do so now, but I can tell you during my meditation, I got the same vibes as in my U.S. election reading again, that for some reason, Joe Biden will step out of politics very soon. And um, yeah, we will just start the reading now and ask the cards for more details. Maybe the cards want to tell us something about him. So... Please, spirits, what is the current energy of Joe Biden at this point in time? What is he dealing with? Two cards flipped out. I will take them both. We got the Four of Swords. It's, it's the rest card talking about fear, anxiety, feeling stress, overwhelmed, mental overload, needing solitude hospitalization, healing. I get this very heavy energies right now that he's at a breaking point somehow. He's, if he continues to work as much as he does right now, he will really have a breakdown. He's full of stress right now and full of anxiety. That's what I get. The second card is the Queen of Wands. Good business sense, confidence, foresight. An attractive, magnetic, mature woman, a helpful friend who is well liked. A kind and loyal, generous, confident, competitive woman. Vibrancy. So he's getting some support, heavy support at this point in time, either from his wife to overcome all this hard work and this stress and um, almost um, physical breakdown. I get this very strongly. He's dealing with some major health issues also, and he's getting all the support to keep on continuing from a feminine part in his life. And I feel this is his wife. Let's see. Why is the Queen of Wands here for Joe Biden? Death card. Spiritual transformation, new beginnings, letting go, endings, change, transition, sudden or unexpected upheaval, endings and release. The stress he's feeling right now could also be connected to this woman by his side. There's something going on in his private life. That's what I get right now very heavily. Some kind of unexpected change when it comes to this Queen of Wands person. Spirit, give me more information. What is this all about? Why is he feeling stressed up out about this Queen of Wands, this woman around him? The moon... Intuition, illusions, dreams, vagueness, instability, anxiety, fear, subconscious insecurity. So to me, it seems that there is something going on with the feminine part playing a leading role in his life. And this can only be his wife. There's something not right when it comes maybe to her health. He's feeling that she's transforming and... Um, there's some kind of instability surrounding this relationship at this point in time. And this is why Joe Biden, 
he himself is very weak when it comes to his health. That's obvious. But he's also weakened even more because of a private battle he has to struggle with at this point in time and which is not obvious to the public right now. So let's see. Please, Spirit, give me three cards for Joe Biden when it comes to the U.S. presidency and the elections in 2024. Will he become president again? Show me three cards, please. The first card is the Eight of Swords, talking about feeling trapped, restricted, backed into a corner, victimized, paralyzed, feeling pressure, hopelessness, powerlessness, silence, dilemma. So this is a clear note to me. I've, even when I did the readings um, on the U.S. elections 2024, I feel for some reason Joe Biden is out of this, out of the game. There is too much pressure and anxiety around him, maybe even some kind of unexpected change happening in his private life, which will force him to pull back from the polit political scenery. But let's see. The second card is the Seven of Swords, making a break for it. Deceit, lies, trickery, cheating, theft, dangerous, risky behavior. Escaping interconnection. So again, this is making a break from politics. He's not able to deal with all this anymore in the next few months. And um, I get this uh, great urge of him right now that he wants to focus more on his private life. He's tired of all the fighting when it comes to his um election battle and him running as a president again he will not be able to um, deal with all the things that are that public wants him to handle for the united states because he's somehow trapped Let's see, the third card is passion, knight of wands, being hasty, quick decisions, ambition. Negotiators, debaters, those who love a challenge. Hmm, I think it will be a very quick decision for him. In this case, this card wants to tell me that he will get out of the game very soon. Let's see, why is the knight of wands here? Give me another clarifier. For the Knight of Wands. We got the Hermit. Yeah, soul searching, spiritual enlightenment, introspection, inner guidance and solitude. Expect him to pull back from his obligations and his work in politics very soon. He will go into some kind of Hermit mode and be in solitude. I don't feel he will be next U.S. president. I had this feeling in the other readings I did um, concerning the U.S. elections too. It will be a very quick decision made by him in the next few weeks and months. And he will announce that he will, again, as I told you, pull back, maybe um, give up even his... Um, job as a U.S. president before the end of the elections because there's something in his private life and also, yeah, in his private life that he needs to put his focus on and he's also not capable when it comes to his own health. There's too much uh, stress and he's feeling too overwhelmed with all the things that will happen in his private life in the next few months that it will be his own decision. He wants to go in the hermit mode and stop this. And I think he will retire. So let's see. I will pull one last card from the Sacred Symbols Oracle deck as a confirmation what Spirit maybe wants to tell us about his situation. 
I don't want to tell you nothing wrong, but this is the feeling that I get during the reading that he will, two cards came out, I will keep them, that he will um, pull back and retire. And we got two cards. It's knowledge and divine masculine. He's a very wise man. That's what I get with this picture. And um, he needs to stand up for his own life right now. But I will read both of them, both of these cards from the book to you. Knowledge, remain teachable. There is a new wisdom available to you at this time. This card can signify getting more information before proceeding. It can also signify the presence of an important teacher. Or perhaps you are the teacher and it's time to share your knowledge and gifts with the world around you. Drawing this card can also indicate a message from your Akashic Records. Seek out more information about the records or even perhaps learn how to access your own records for more clarity regarding your query. Meditate on this to learn new things or to draw the right teachers into your life. So... He's pulling back again. I see this with this card. He, he gained so much wisdom. He wants to focus on his life purpose and things are coming to an end for him. I will read this second card also. The Divine Masculine card. The Divine Masculine is the embodiment of logic, direct action and strength. It is most in, in his most evolved aspect he represents the builder the protector and the guardian drawing this card can symbolize that divine masculine energy is needed to balance your current situation it can also represent father brother healing and the healing of relationships with the divine masculine in your life and as i told you there is very much healing needed in his life right now at this point in time he has to be some kind of father figure or he has to show his total mas masculine power to this woman. She needs him right now at this point in time. He will pull back. He will be wise. And um, I can't tell you nothing more than I see him giving up his duties and obligations in the next few weeks and months. I told you I'm an intuitive reader and this is what the pictures now show me during this reading in my visions also. The time of him being in the public will come to an end this year, that's for sure. So please be aware this is not any kind of, uh, when I do readings on po politicians, this is not uh, my personal opinion or any kind of um, influence um, I want to deliver to you. This is just a neutral reading as a request to my followers. And um, it is not my personal opinion. Again, these are the energies that Spirit show me. And I hoped it helped you. And write me in the comments what you think about this reading. Please also, you may like to check out my US election video. And I also did a reading on Donald Trump. Maybe you can compare all these readings together. But for Joe Biden, his time as a US president to me is clearly over. So... Yeah, I'll stop the reading now. I wish you a blessed day wherever you are in the world and goodbye.